around the world in 80 days. I saw it in London. I was four years old on a huge screen, and I was completely transported by that. I suppose that that's influenced me over the years because that experience of going on an adventure at the movies uh, is something that I'll, I'll always carry with me, and I like, to, I like to try to accomplish it when I can as a director. Well, I really liked Martian for that. Uh, although I wouldn't want to be alone on Mars. The Martian? Yes. Uh, the, you want to go on Mars. <laughs> uh, I, 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 I like that, I like the idea of that, sort of the, that, of that sort of, uh, that, that, that sort of, you know, basic adventure where, you know, you're, uh, somebody is, uh, um, is, is coping. But I also liked Castaway, so maybe this says something about me. That's a big question. I'm not sure I could. <laughs> no, I don't think I'd make it. I don't have very many skills. <laughs> Oh, underrated. Um, wow. It's always hard to say because some people really like the ones, even the underrated ones, you know. But um, I, uh, there's, a, there's a simple charm um, and an affection that I've always had for the movie t uh, Far and Away uh, with uh, Tom Cruise and Nicole Kidman. It's very playful. It's kind of romantic. Uh, it's, uh, it's, it's very idealistic. But it has a lot of scenes that I, that I really like. I also, however, Almost 180 degrees from that, I made a western with Kate Blanchett and Tommy Lee Jones called *The Missing*, that I'm very, very proud of. And uh, you know, the people who like that movie uh, re really love it. Uh, other people were sort of put off by it, and it and it wasn't seen by uh, you know a, a, a lot of people really. It didn't wasn't a big box office success, but but uh, that's a movie that I'm proud of. <laughs>